Hello and welcome to my channel. In this video we are going to solve an example from trigonometry. Now this question has two sub questions. So let us start with the first one. The diagram shows a cuboid A B C D E F G H. A B is given as 14 cm, B C as 5 and C G as 8 cm. M is the midpoint of H G. Calculate B M. So let us come back to this given diagram. We have to find out what is the length of BM. So let me highlight this. And the second information given is M is the midpoint of HG. Which means it divides the length of HG into two equal halves. Now let us drop down a straight line from point M till the side DC. So we have drawn a straight line from point M till the length DC and we have labeled it as N. Now N becomes the midpoint of DC. Now using point N, let us draw another straight line parallel to BC that joins at AB. And let us mark that point as P. Now M is the midpoint of HG, N is the midpoint of DC and P is the midpoint of AB. Now the length of MN becomes 8 because it is parallel to GC. So let us write here 8. And the length of NP becomes equal to 5 because it is parallel to BC. So let us write 5 here. And since N is the midpoint of DC and the length of DC is equal to 14 because AB and CD are parallel. Now the 14 gets divided as length 7 and NC also becomes 7. Similarly AP becomes 7 and PB becomes 7. Next since ABCD was a rectangle because it is the base of a cuboid. Now PBCN also becomes a rectangle because it is a part of the bigger rectangle. So the angle P becomes 90 degree. Now once we have found the lengths, let us join the point N and B. Now P N B becomes a right angled triangle, right angled at point P. So let me redraw this triangle again here. So we have redrawn the triangle P N B. So P B is 7 cm and P N is 5 cm. So we can find out the length of B N by using the Pythagoras theorem. So we can write. So the hypotenuse square that is B N square is equal to 7 square plus 5 square. Taking the square on the other side of equal to sign, we get square root of 7 square is 49 and 5 square is 25. So finally we get the value of Bn as 8.602. So let us write over here. So Bn we have written 8.602. Now we have to actually find out the length of Bm. So we can consider this right angle triangle BNM. It is right angle because we have dropped down a straight line from the midpoint till the length DC. So here we get a right angle triangle at point N. So let me redraw this triangle again. So we have redrawn the triangle here that is BMN where MN is 8 cm and BN we just found it out as 8.602. Now we have to find out BM. Now BM is again the hypotenuse so we can make use of Pythagoras theorem. So we write. So BM square is equal to 8 square plus 8.602 square. Now taking the square again on the other side of equal to sign, we get square root of 8 square plus 8.602 square. So here we get the value as 11.747 or rounding it we can write it as 11.75 centimeter. So this is the length of BM. Now let us move on to the second sub question. Calculate the angle that BM makes with the base ABCD. So let me highlight this. So this is the base ABCD and this is the line BM given. So we have to find out what is the angle made by this line BM with the base ABCD. So to find this out again let us refer to the diagram which we did in the first part of this question. So here we have taken the first diagram in which we had found the length of BN. Now here if we find out the angle between BM and BN then that would be same as the angle made by BM with the base ABCD. Now let us take this angle BMN as X and the side opposite to angle X is 8 so this becomes the opposite side and the side opposite to the 90 degrees BM so this becomes the hypotenuse and 8.602 becomes default the adjacent side and here since we have the opposite side and the adjacent side we can make use of the tangent trigonometric ratio to find the value of angle X. So let me write here. So tan x is equal to opposite side which is 8 over the adjacent side which is 8.602. So taking tan on the other side of equal to sine we get x equal to tan inverse of 8 over 8.602. 
So solving this we get the value of x as 42.92 degrees. So let me write here the value of x or the angle made by BM with base ABCD is 42.92 degrees. I hope you have understood all the steps and liked the video. And if you found the video interesting then you can click on this playlist and find more videos on trigonometry. And if you are liking my videos like share and subscribe to my channel and thank you for watching.